Hi guys, welcome to my Flatlands ride. This is Cahors to Toulouse. It's a 117 kilometer ride uh, and it will take us approximately 50 minutes. That's pretty good riding. Okay, so remember, play your own music in the background. Something nice and upbeat to keep you motivated. I'll try and motivate you along the way. The other thing, um, you need to make sure you've got your bike set up correctly as I would set up, okay, so I took refer to gears, um, so if you set your bike up correctly in that relation, then when I'm calling gear numbers out, you'll be uh, using the right gear. We're also going to be working with cadence on this one, um, or I say beats, beats to, uh, per minute. Um, each beat is a pedal stroke, so that will be right, left, right, left on the beats, okay? Your cadence is actually half of that figure. So I'll have the cadence on the go. It is a flatland ride, uh, some slight undulations in it all the way. Um, and it's a 50 minute ride, okay? So, first thing you need to do is get yourself into gear 4. And set my uh, stopwatch up because it's all done to time. Okay, so you need to be in gear four, and we are going to make a start. Okay, so here's the cadence we're working on at the minute two, three, four, one, two, three, four, two, three, four. Just nice and steady. This is our warm up. We're just riding out of the cahors. Nice and steady away. So we need to be keeping ankles, knees, hips in alignment. We need that push and pull action. So you put, you're not just relying on pushing down all the time. So body's nice and upright. Chest open, so we can get plenty of oxygen in. Good. Great stuff. Arms should be slightly bent. Hands in a number two position. Great stuff. So, tactics we're going to employ today is when the going gets a little bit tough, we're going to put pedal to the metal a little bit. And we're going to try and drive away, break the group up. That's going to be our tactics, I've no doubt. Some of the other tactics will be to try and sprint. So there'll be quite a few attacks going on. Our job is to make sure we sit on their wheels. And then when the route favours us, we'll drive at them. And we'll do that generally when it's a little bit of an incline. We'll pick the tempo up and drive it on. Okay, take it again, four, uh, five. Yeah, our tempo's going up a little bit. That's it. So at the moment we're heading towards the Montant. Keep that tempo with me. Gear five. Warming up nicely. Some top riders with us today, so we'll try and make sure we don't allow them to get away from us. 
So I think my mechanics work on my bike very well this morning. A few little squeaks, but it doesn't like being in these low gears. That little squeak probably goes off when I get up into the next gear. Okay, so give me gear six. Goes, and we'll take that tempo up a little bit more. Okay. Passing through the one tat. Nice and warm now. a little section now that favours our style of riding so we're going to try and break this peloton up a little bit so we need a slight climb but we know if we take the tempo we can break the peloton down a bit shrink it down rather than us all riding as one big one big group Doing good. Riding well. Only a few more stages of this tour left. Take it, gear seven. Pick that tempo up now. Good. Let's keep that going. This is us on the front of the train now. Legs of the sprinters, and this is a sprinter stage. The only way we're going to get a result on this one is if we can rip this peloton apart. We've got to keep the pressure on when we can. Go on, come on. You're working it. Keep that going. Flatten out a little bit. Then we've got a little bit of a downhill. So you get a chance to have a drink then. And gear six. We've got tempo. We're not quitting the tempo. We'll stretch the pellet on out a bit now.
Good. Sit down, here we go. Give five. Nice and steady it is. Now, Neil, a quick drink. Back to gear six. See, Jumbo Visma, they've just took the, fetch their team to the front to pick the pace back up again. Let's keep that tempo. We're sitting in with them. That tempo there. Oh, Tim Wellens of Lotto Sedan's jumped up. We go, Sprinty, catch him, get on his wheel, come on. Sprint it out. And you're on his wheel, sit back down. Ride with him, hold him. We ain't letting anybody get away. Now, come on, spin it out. Here you get back. You're on his wheel now. Hit that tempo. Ah, oh, Tim Warren's gone again. Lotus and Al. Up we go, come on, sprint it! Get on his wheel! And back! Can't fall, let these guys get away! That tempo. Oh, Dan Martin's gone again. He's really still. Come on. Get on his wheel. Pulling back. And down. Okay, they just ease the pace back a bit. Those attacks certainly split the part in half now. 
coming back to a section slightly uphill. This is where we're going to employ our tactics again. Try and break them. Here we go, gear seven. Pick that tempo. Just coming through Fontana's. I should say coming up to Fontana's. Don't go there yet. Keep that tempo. Should be gear seven. Well, we're going to make the most of the sections of this race that suit us. Many good sprinters in this pack, we're still. Keep it going. Yeah, 8 out of 10, intensity level. Here we go, flattened up, gear 6. Keep that tempo. Another slight downhill coming up. Gonna get a drink shortly. Once we hit the downhill, push and pull, remember, push and pull. Ride them well. Downhill. Downhill, get yourself a quick drink. Steady away. Keep the tempo. Flattened out, gear six. Any else going to do is I've just come to the front now. They're picking the tempo up. We're just approaching Fontanes. Uh, there's points up for ward for sprints. Keep that nice and steady, come on. Well, it should be 8 out of 10 still.
Go on, Pascal. Ah, come on, the Boris team's gone. Go for it, come on. Sprint it out. Sprint. Get on his wheel. Bring it back. Look there. Keep that tempo. Tempo. Oh, bloody hell, Hugh Garth, he's going now. The yeah, F Pro Cycling. Come on. I'm back. Well, we're in front tailings now. Ah, right, Chris Broom's gone! Chris Broom, here he is, Grenadiers! You're on his wheel! Easy back. Sit. Turn the tons ease back a bit. Keep riding. Keep riding, I need to stop and restart. Going back to us now. Going to go uphill again. But we're going to ride a little bit harder this time. Still a steady climb, but it's on gear seven. Yeah, that's our tempo. 208 beats a minute on 104 cadence. Push and pull. Come on, we're stretching them out. We're slowly breaking. They're trying to break us. So we have to apply our tactics when we can. So it should be about eight and a half. Intensity level out of 10, between eight and nine. Push and pull. We're on route to Montauban. On our way to Toulouse. Heading towards Montauban. Come on, keep that intensity going. We need to be out front by the time we get to Toulouse. So we won't beat these sprinters otherwise. Working it, come on, keep that tempo. We're splitting this group right up now. Only the strongest survive. Should be up there, nine out of ten. Give you six. It's flattened off.
Tempo's just dropped a little bit. Well, it should be up there, 9 out of 10. Downhill coming up, pretty short downhill though, takes longer to go up, it just to come down. Keep that tempo, come on. Okay, downhill we go, gear five. Keep the tempo, get a drink. Halfway down. And gear six. Look at that tempo. One of the F Pro Cycling's got a few riders on the front at the minute. Oh, we're a group of 13. 13 riders now. We've broken them down. We're fortunate. The finish is on a slight incline up, suits us down the ground that. And that's from a good three kilometres out. Keep it going, come on. Should be eight out of ten. We've had a little recovery. As we're approaching Montabarn. And Pascal Ackman's gone again from Team Bora. Come on, on his tail. Get on that wheel. And easy back. Easy back. We're there. We're not letting anybody go. This is our race for the take in this stage. Oh, bloody hell, good old Mar Martino. Can't do this. Come on. Get on these wheel. And easy back. Give that tempo. Keep the tempo. <clears throat> oh, bloody hell! Tim Wallens, what was the bell's gone now? Come on. Spinning it out, and back. Pick your tempo up. Come on, we're doing well. We keep picking up second and third on these little sprint outs. Should be out nine out of ten. Oh, Dan Martin's gone now, he's really startled. And easy back. Pick the tempo. Keep on that gear six. 
So Mo just eased a bit. Chris Froman and Richard Carapaz have took the front, trying to calm things down. On our way to campus now. Come back to part of the route that favours us again. Should be well at 9 out of 10. Okay. P7, let's up the ante. You find this is too easy? Up to gear end. Keep this tempo though. Come on, you should be running at 9 out of 10. Certainly, no less than 8.5. Tempo, come on. We've got Campus, Saint Alban, and then we're up to Loose. Still approaching Campus, both Campus and Saint Alban, quite close together. Flattens out again, remember. Top of this little slight climb. But we're going to keep the pressure on. We're going to keep this, this pace. Come on. Should be 9 out of 10 effort at this half a minute. Get this chest up though. Plenty of oxygen in. Keep those knees in, ankles, knees, hips. All in alignment. Arms relaxed. There, flattening out. G6. A little bit longer downhill coming up. That beat, come on. Every beat, a foot stroke. Keep it going. Long is flat. There's only nine or ten of us in this now. Ten of us in this group. Still at 9 out of 10. You're doing good, come on. We're going to go downhill. Gear 5. Keep that tempo. A drink.
Keep working it, come on. Between eight and nine now, be a six. Primrose, Rolex took the lead, picked the ante up. He's seeing if he can break us as well now. I think that's a bad move on him. I think he knows if he doesn't shake us off, he won't be able to stay with us. So Primoz Roglic, Jumbo Visma, is out front leading this train. We just sat in there. We're approaching campus. The place is hot up now. Ten now. We got ten now. Oh, Pascal, I can move. Bob is attacked. Get on his wheel. And easy back. Oh, Tim Mullins is gone. Spring it out, come on. And back. Well, we'll be right up there now. About 99% there. 100. 101. 
Oh, we're in campus now, flying through campus. I'm going mad, it's just gone, come on. I shot it. Off now. There's eight of us now. Bullock, Carapaz, Carpy, Martin, Room, Wellens, you, me. We know if we can stay with these, the finish is ours. It's either you or me. But we're the best endurance based riders. It's not the best sprinters. The good hill climbers as well. It's not the best sprinters. So we've got to break these sprinters. Keep that tempo. Should be between eight and nine. Have a 10 effort level. Room, just come through, steady pace, pick the tempo up. And he's trying to sell Carapaz. And Roglic's gone, come, sprint it out, Roglic's gone. And back, we're on his way up. He's got 10 more. Oh, Roglic's kicking again. Is he back? In the tempo. Jim Wellens has dropped off now. So is Pascal Otterman. Martin, Carthy, Carapaz, Rob Lake, you and me left. Come on, we're going to hold them off. Carapaz is kicked! Come back. Carapaz is trying to break us. Carapaz goes again! And he's off. From a slight uphill. This is us, gear seven. Should be between nine and ten. Well, hopefully nine. Keep that tempo. It's 
Tight little hill this is. Uh, 3,000 meter mark for the finish. We're past St Alvin. Heading for Toulouse now. You, me, Dan Martin, Hugh Carthy, Richard Carapaz, and Primoz Roglic. Two defence champion, 2020. He's struggling now. He's struggling. Let's keep it going, come on. Should be between 9 and 10 now, 9 out of 10. Two thousand five hundred meters to go. Let's keep this intensely going. I'm at ninety five percent. Still enough in the tank, the ratio. Come on, we need to up the ante a little bit. That's Dan Martin broken, he's done. 2,000 metres to go. Go on, take over the front now. Up the intensity a bit. Here we go, come on. Last thousand metres, it goes up a little bit higher. But we need to keep this intensity on. Come on. Should certainly be at nine out of ten. If you're not, put the intensity on a little bit. Add a little bit to your gear. So you've not quite got your gears right. When the sun's beaming down on you. Fans are lying in the street. Come on, 1500 metres to go. You, Carpy, gone. You, me, Richard Carapaz. That's all that's left. Come on. Push pull, push pull. The chick out of the just took the front. Okay, here he goes up here a little bit, get it right. Thousand metres to go. Come on. Oh, I'm just easing past Richard Carapaz now. I don't think he's got the legs for this tempo. Well, 96%. That's the 750 meter mark. Oh, your legs are starting to struggle now. Those legs are burning. Time to race to go. I'm just put edging away from you. 99% of that. And my bike's distance now. Ooh. 
hundred percent. Two hundred fifty meters. Oh, you pull them back slightly. I'm not resting though. Under one percent. I'm picking the tempo up now. That's it. And foot takes it. Gear six. Right, into those. Hit that tempo. One hour cool down. Hope you enjoyed that. Tactics work well. A little bit slower. Keep those legs moving, see? It's a slow fall back to the heart. I'm ready for the next stage. Next stage coming up soon. Here, five. See yourself up. Keep the tempo. Good drink. Ride with me, pushing me to the limits to the end there. Eh? Good effort. Ease it down a bit. enjoyed spinning with me obviously look out for some of my other right if you're into other way workouts as well kettlebells weight circuit um, call CV work there's loads of different routines on the uh, channel back a bit more. I'm at 7 out of 10 now, 70% maximum heart rate. It's the easy one. So I'm cooling down, allowing our heart to come down gradually with the assistance of our lower limbs, squeezing the blood back, to prevent blood pooling, to prevent us having a heart attack. So our heart was working very hard, when it's working hard like that, can't pump the blood around itself. Can't pump it around fast enough so they'll become a blood lag and we get blood pooling in the lower extremities. So it's imperative 
no matter what you do, when you're exercising, cool down, assist that heart because you never know if you've got a heart condition and it could just suddenly happen, okay? So take my advice, always cool down. If you need to now, jump to my cool down video or my stretch off video because we've now cooled down sufficiently and we're going to call it a day. Look forward to riding with you again.